Hello guys, welcome to my channel. In this video, we will troubleshoot the issue related to Windows update. Whichever version or whichever Windows you are using, this video is for you. We will troubleshoot the issue one by one. Okay. So first of all, Windows 10 or 11 and other version come with by default Windows update troubleshooter. So go to search bar, type for troubleshoot. And you will see this option troubleshoot setting. Click on that. We will apply the basic settings first and then we will move to the advanced options. Click on here additional troubleshooter. And you need to look for Windows update. You need to just run it and let it run and it will automatically detect your issue. Now in my case, I am using latest Windows. And I always recommended you also to update your windows for security as well as for your windows health. Okay, you can see I'm using the latest windows, but still you can regularly click on check for update. Okay. Okay. Now if this fix your problem, just restart your system and close it. Okay. You need to restart your system once the Windows update tool is done. Okay, still not fixed. We can move to the second method. In the second method, go to search bar, type as services, and sometimes we disable it. So we need to make sure that Windows update is enabled from services. Click anywhere on it and look for Windows update in a W series. Press W on your keyboard. And scroll it down and look for this option windows update make sure it is running you need to right click on that go to its properties and select the type automatic or manual okay whichever you want if you selected manual you need to manually check for update and if you check this option automatic your windows will automatically update your windows okay i suggest you to choose this option and run the service click on apply Click on OK and it is automatically running. But this may consume the more data, so you can choose this option manual update. Okay, you can manually update your windows. If this option is still not working and your window is already running inside the background, we can move to the website. Okay, we can go to directly to Microsoft website and we will update the Windows tool from there. Open any browser and look for Windows Update Tool, Windows 10 Download and hit enter and you will see this option download Windows 10 disk image ISO file. I will give you a direct link of this website. So now you can see this option update now option. Click on this tool and it will automatically download here you can see and you need to just double click on it to run and it will automatically perform all the updates and there is no loss of your data in this process let me download this and i will show you how to install this update you can also check here the version 22s2 at the point of making video this is the latest version of windows 10 now it is download we need to go to the download options open download now you can see windows 10 upgrade double click on it to run click on yes button when the prompt opens now it will look like this thank you for updating the latest version i am using already using the latest window you need to look for next option next option okay and then then you need to let it run and your system will automatically restart. It will check the hard disk space as well on your window. So make sure you have enough and your issue will be fixed with this step. This is very powerful step and your issue will be fixed. If uh, still not fixed, we can check for last update which we have installed on our windows. Sometimes corrupted windows can cause this issue as well go to control panel 
open it choose the large icon share programs and features now you can see windows view window install updates and click on this option install on so that you can see the latest windows here now you need to select the latest option here like security update for windows okay and this option windows for update for microsoft windows and you need to uninstall one by one all the latest update you need to select one by one and then also you can run this tool which we have installed from the official website and your issue will be fixed if still not fixed we can go to the cmd run it as administrator yes button when the prompt opens sometime windows file are corrupted so we can hit this command sfc so we can hit this command sfc space slash scan now this will repair the windows corruption once it is done restart your system and check if your issue is solved or not so hope your issue is fixed now if your issue is fixed then hit like subscribe and share thank you thanks for watching